I have one win so far. That might be a miracle in its own. So I'm looking for more, obviously. And this team did very well in the last game, if I remember correctly. Because, I don't know, in Ranked? Ranked, it's been weird lately. Ranked has been some games... Well, more so games are just... No runs are scored. But BR, BR is just a flip of a coin for the most part. So if you didn't see the draft, this is the team I was able to draft. This is the new Ernie Banks. Uh, the only way you can get this card is if you go 12-0, so it's a flawless reward, or if you uh, just buy him off the market. But he's like 400,000 subs right now, so probably the best way to do it would be to get the flawless reward. This is the gold Adam Lind. The only reason I chose this Adam Lind over Nelson Cruz, I think it was, was because I needed lefties. Lind has good stats versus righties. Jay Buhner is the righty. Joey Gallo in this game, 100%. Matt Carpenter has plus five versus lefties. This is a good thing today, too. A lot of players have amazing inside edges. Plus 15, plus 14, plus eight. Only problem is the catcher because only a 68 overall and he has terrible hitting stats the bullpen is all right too no bad inside edges familia has plus 10 uh bastardo is a flashback so he does not have any inside edges and canely he has all right stats let's go like i was saying i'm going back to the roots of playing at fenway because that was the only time i was able to do well playing br that was last year but still Fenway was the only option. He has Ozzy Albies, Chris Davis, Steve Garvey. He has Trout, Sano, Eugenio Suarez. He has the Gold Otani and Francisco Cervelli. So he actually has a very good offense. Kind of the same for both sides. If he made that play, I don't like this, though. He does have three righties in a row. All amazing players, so let's go Familia. I wonder when he'll take off, because he definitely will be at some point in time. Nice pitch. That is a huge out right there. He doesn't seem to be taking off. He's not even taking a lead. Do I even need to go to the slide step is the question, because he's swinging away. He doesn't give a shit. He is teeing off on everything. Oh, he didn't swing at that. Again, a nice slaughter, but this is when I have to be careful. This is Trout. To be safe, that wasn't even supposed to be close to the zone. Whoa, no, what the hell was that? What? It was nowhere close. Don't walk him. Please don't walk him. I walked him. Nice pitch. I had Trotto too, I think, and I walked him, so don't do the same thing. Second. All right. Ernie Banks. Ernie Banks! Ernie Banks! First pitch the squad sees is launched. Well, shit. Buner. That terrible animation at third base strikes again. Gone. Nope. Maybe. Maybe? He took the strangest route to that ball. It was bad news from the start. Holy shit. Was he safe? He should at least score one. Doesn't take a strange route to it this time. He makes the grab. Both with 43 speed. Down the line. That's fair. Kozar delivers. All right. No mistakes. I have not seen, I don't think, anybody use this gold. Well, Otani absolutely destroyed that. That didn't have a chance of staying in. That 
is brutal. Who the hell is throwing high sliders like that? Catch this! Dive! Nice slaughter. Finally, a good pitch was thrown. Only one run. Man, this would be nice if I was able to... Oh, no. Don't do it. Is this motherfucker insane? Banks may have done it again. Screw that. I need... To just throw strikes. That's pretty much the only thing that needs to happen. Is throw... Strikes. First out, always important. That wasn't anywhere close to where that was supposed to be. Should be it! That's two. Alright, so he has Billy Hamilton, Bellinger, Goldschmidt, Judge, Utley. Kozar, Pee Wee Reese, and Austin Barnes. His offense is incredible. Particular guys in the lineup. Popped him up. Goldschmidt. That's so bad. Nice at bat so far. A lot of pitches have been thrown. This is an amazing at bat from Lind right now. If he's able to get on base, that's huge. And he lays off here. Ball. Out boy. Damn, that was right down the pipe, almost, almost it was. Good at bat again from Buhner. But then he does that. Shit. Don't do it. Throw his ass out, throw his ass out. Again, that may have been the best pitching I've done. I don't think that makes sense. The best pitching I've done. The best pitching I've done. Land. He did. This is it. I'm not going longer than three innings. That's just bullshit. Get out. Not even close to a chance. I have absolutely nobody on the bench right now, so I really have no expectations for this at bat. But it is the top of the order after this. I pray he walks him. That would be amazing if he walked him. With Banks coming up. He did. I don't believe it. The first pitch to him. Pulled toward right center field. After it is Hamilton. Damn! I just missed those. Runner breaks for third. Now a bunt attempt here. Carpenter scoops it. Sit down. Way the old one pitch. Get on the ground the third. Finally. I don't want this to go any further. This is bullshit. Go! Ernie, let's go, buddy! Three, two, count with Adam Lind on deck! And it's popped up. Ah, oh, man. This is way too long. Anything over three innings in BR is unacceptable. Jay Buhner absolutely crushed that. And it gives the squad the lead most importantly. A flyout. That's a surprise. Well, he made that look easy as hell. We all know it needs to happen right now. Should be one. That's one. 
Nice pitch again, Abreu. Don't choke, Abreu. After many, many millenniums, this is over. Jay Buhner, of course. Of course. That was the only thing that happened in this damn game. Alright, well that'll be it for this video. Not much needs to be said about that. That was just way too long. Longer than it should have been. Buhner gets the... The solo shot, that is the difference. He didn't even have a hit. That's interesting. But anyway, that'll be it for this video. Hope everyone enjoyed. If you did, be sure to leave a thumbs up down below. If you are new to the channel, subscribe as well. I will see everybody in the next video.